What's up, everybody? You know what? We're back for another video. In this video, I am going to show you a new project that I'm working on. I'm either going to turn this into a poster or I'm going to have it as a t-shirt. Or who knows? I may do both. The quote is, it says, dying young, dying young is overrated. And I've just been sketching out, trying different placements to type, different styles. Trying to make it to where it's going to be very legible and easy to read. And it speaks, I know this quote speaks to me and a lot of other people out there as well. Because there's nothing cool about dying young. Living your life and getting old. It's, to me, is very, seems much more funner. Seems much more fun than dying young. Okay, so let's go through the steps that I've been going through. So I started out here just trying to work out the placement and doing some sans serif and then script and then sans serif and then ending it with the script and then trying to add some little bits here and there, trying to find out which one I feel would work good. And then picked up some brush pens, trying them out there and then just trying some different scripts. Then I even thought about maybe doing it in a graffiti style would be cool. No, that didn't work at all. As you see, it's... That is a language that only a select group of people could read. And onto this page, this one right here to me is the strongest and what I'm going to go with. This is as a starting point. My main thing was I wanted to focus on the three words. I, th I feel that these are the strongest. Dying young. Let me adjust the camera so you can see it. There we go. That is better. I feel that these three words are very strong and they get the message across. And also this style how I went about it. It's very, very strong and it is legible. So for this, I'm going to take it into Procreate. Goodness, what are they doing upstairs? And we're gonna take this into Procreate, get everything laid out how I'd want it to be, and the colors and all that, and then I'm gonna take it into Illustrator and vectorize it. When I take an illustrator and vectorize it, what I'm most likely going to, going to use is the image trace tool just to keep some of the grittiness to it and to not lose that human hand-drawn aspect. And then here's a few more sketches. I did not really like these because to me they weren't, it's just what, what I wasn't looking for. And for the is, when I take it in appropriate, I have to do some more studying. And because who knows, the way how this looks here currently, the placement and everything could change. And it's going to be very, very fun to see what this turns into. And I want to say thank you so much for tuning in. As always, I appreciate all your love and support. And... I'm very excited to see what this turns into. And I'll catch you in the next one. Stay tuned to my Instagram. And as always, let me know what your thoughts are below. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you have not done so yet. And I cannot believe it. All these new people who have subscribed, you all are amazing for doing so. And I appreciate you. And thank you for taking the time to just Scroll to the bottom and tap that subscribe button. Leave that like, the comments. It's a, it's a wonderful feeling. And I'll catch you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching.